Hi all, welcome to the best of CAT series by IMS and today we are going to look at a question on number system. Kindly give it a try. So pause the video and then resume the video once you are done with it. So in this particular sum, it says that if the sum of the squares of two numbers happen to be 97, which of the following cannot be? Please be careful about the word cannot be their product. So what is given to me is if I assume the numbers to be x and y, one can say from the first part that x square plus y square is given to you as 97. And we want to basically comment on which of the following cannot be the product over here. So again, definitely there can be multiple possible ways in which you can find out the x square plus y square to be equal to a 97. If people will think on the lines of integers, possibly they might say, okay, the number x could be a possible 9 and y could be a 4 because 81 plus 16 happened to be nothing but 97. But they have not told us that the value need to be a uh, integer. The value of x and y need to be a integer. So again, if I ask you a simple question, if the sum is known to you and we have to comment about the product, what property are we going to use? And the definite answer basically has to be again uh, am more than equals to gm. So if I assume my variables to be x square and y square, both of which are going to be definitely a positive quantity, since square of something is going to become a positive quantity, one can say if I use am more than equals to gm, can we say that x square plus y square divided by 2 should be more than equals to square root of the product of what x square into y square? So I will now get 97 divided by 2 to be more than equals to my RHS part becomes square root of x square into y square become x into y. So can I say one thing here that x into y must be less than equals to 97 divided by 2 giving us the number 48.5. So whatever be the case the value of x and y cannot exceed the number 48.5 and if I look at the option choices one can safely mark option number four as the answer over here. Now, please note, one can also think about the positive values of x or a negative values of x, but in whatever case it cannot, let's say, go beyond the number 48.5 or it can't go beyond the number minus 48.5 as well. So now once you have understood this particular question, kindly give it a try to the replica question and put your answer in the comment section.